Good day, viewers. Welcome to BSU TV. My name is Efo Samofin Folua Usazua from the Department of Mass Communication, Benin State University. On today's episode, we'll be talking about automobile and we will be emphasizing on scanning and tracking of automobiles. In technology today, we places in Nigeria like Benue State is behind in technology. So because of the olden days technology, we have advanced to the modern days technology. And the modern days technology aid efficiency, speed, it improves time, it saves time. And today we have come to a mechanic workshop to interview some of the mechanics there on tracking and scanning of automobiles cars. Please, can you introduce yourself to the audience? Okay. I'm Aminu by name. So, I'm born and brought up in Makodi, Ibiara by tribe. Okay. So, can you tell us how you started your workshop? How it was, the process? The process. Before you, before you have a workshop, you have to learn by being someone apprentice, like your boss apprentice. After being an apprentice for, a, for, a, for some years, then when your master gets you free, then you can open your own workshop. Okay. Did you read this course in the university or what did you study? No, no, no. I didn't read it in the university. Okay. I just learned it, like, skills. Okay. Yeah. Thank you, sir. So, how does automobile save time? How does it save time? Automobile save time. Save time. For instance, when you want to deliver a message, maybe from here to North Bank, instead of tracking, eh, when you take a, a bike, it will save your time and be very fast. Okay. Using modern tools for scanning, how efficient is it in automobiles? Well, using the modern tools, it will save your time. Secondly, it will it kind of give you exactly what you want. For instance, when your car is having an issue of a breakdown, instead of you to be like gazing, touching a different part, when you use it to see, to tell you exactly what is the cause of that breakdown. I mean, maybe breakdown, for, yes, let me know. So when you use it to see, it will save your time and it will give you exactly what you want and what, what the problem is. Okay, sir. What is the what is the comparison using traditional method and advanced technology automobile tools? Comparison. Like this modern method before for instance when you have a problem, maybe your car is not firing, giving you a misfiring, so we have to Pass it through long process by losing the plug, nozzles, and other things to know which one is bad. But this modern tools we are using, it can tell you exactly if it is plugged, it will show you on the computer the problem is plugged. You don't need to lose a lot of things before you know the problem. Okay. We noticed that most people are not educated on modern mechanism. And those that know about it are scared of bringing their cars to modern mechanics. Why is that? Some cars, it's not all cars that you can use the modern tools to scan and use the modern tools to work. Because some cars that start from 1990, I think it's 95, 95 up to date, you can use the modern tools to scan and solve some of their problems. So it's not all car that you can use the to solve. Okay. Why is it that even when people know about it, some don't believe in the efficiency of the tools? Some people, 
doesn't believe on this model is because when you pick your car to a mechanic who you believe that he has the advanced tools to work your car and maybe he doesn't have the enough knowledge to put you through at the end of the work he will use the model tools to scan your car tell you the problem but but lastly your problem will not be solved. So that will give you the wrong impression concerning the tools. Believe that all this, but the tools is real. It helps in plenty way. So having bad impression is due to the mechanic in me. It took us a lot of time to locate this place. So why is it that modern automobile technicians are scarce in the United Well, a modern Techni uh, automobile technicians are scarce because you know this computer of the team is a kind of uh, I don't know how to put it but it came to my code like it entered my code late so it's not something that it's not every place you will find a kind of model tools it's not all workshop you can find this kind of model tools also, you just notice that some people say they still use their own old method. They are still using their old method way of detecting fault and solving problems on signing car. Yeah, you see mechanical, electrical, you can find those kind of tools and they are very expensive also to get. How long does it take a person to learn modern automobile technology? Well, it depends. It depends on your master and the person they are printed. But the minimum, the minimum at least I can say is four years. Or you can even stay more than that, even ten years, depending on how fast you are learning. All right, we have a customer here. So interview the customer and ask him, sir. Why do you prefer to bring your car to the modern mechanics than to the traditional mechanics? Uh, why I prefer this uh, mechanic Chukuma here is because it's educated and has uh, more knowledge on the new modern cars than the local ones. Mm. Okay, sir. Mm. Sir, have you heard about using a device to scan the f and check for the faults in cars? Yes, yes. Okay, and. Has it been used on your car before? Yes, it has been used. Yeah. And the, it, the car was fine when it came back to you? Yeah, very fine, very okay. Okay. I Thank trust you. him. He's a young man, full of knowledge okay. about uh, new cars. Mm. It's okay. not a, our usual local mechanic that we, we forget some notes and tell you that there's no issue. That you should leave those ones. Device that is just in the scanning process. So we have different type of device, but this this one the name is V3 Tech. V3 Tech. We have launch. We have a, ma a maxi diagram. We have a maxi diagram. So we have different type of device. But this one the name is not V3 Tech. That's, that's you can't see. This is the port. Yeah, you will plug in the computer. Listen. Okay. Once you plug in the light, will show to power this. Right. 
okay once you plug it it will power the computer to show you some yeah. icons you stand These are the complaints. Uh, hey, look at this then, is the full details. So you see Linda one is very little bit. Go down Linda two. Linda three is detected. So what's the meaning of those cylinder? Should I explain it? Yes. We notice that people use laptops with these devices. Is there any other device we can use apart from laptops? Scanner. Yes, we can use other device to in place of the laptop. Like we can use your phone in place of the laptop. Uh, normally we use a laptop because we install some of those applications like uh, um, what do you call it? Um, I have forgotten the name, sorry. But we use it in search of some code. When your computer shows you something that you don't you are like you don't understand they will use the laptop but if you don't have laptop you can still use your phone to google it to give you the details of what you want to tell you more about. so right is we can use either we can either google the codes or we download the apps yes you can use you can either google the the code or you use laptop because with the laptop you can go straight without using internet you can get what you want but with phone you need to connect to your internet and i'll go to google to show you more about what you want to do dear viewers we have another boss in the workshop who would be telling us about tracking of cars and the tracking process trackers so has been different different type of them so the modern ones now are the one that when you get them when you store them in the car they give you the same card you put it in your phone so that if anything happens you can track the car immediately with your phone sir is tracking 100 percent guarantee yes it's 100 percent guarantee because one you get this tracker you install it for one year so if you install for one year it's more than one year. The tracker will disappoint you. The car will misbehave. The car will start malfunctioning. Like maybe most of the coil will not be working well, and you might not know what is being the cost. You will run around. But so sometimes what we do is that is why we choose to hold the SIM card because if it happens like that, we are the one to tell you to come and renew the the tracking. Without having any mechanical problem, if the tracking expires, will it have any effect on the brain box of the car? Mm, yes, it will. It will start from the coil. The coil, you'll be having issues like the coil will not be working well, to come to the nozzle, but all those things will happen because the tracking will be powering the light of the brain bus. So the the light that is supposed to come into the coil and the nozzle will not be enough. So you will be thinking is the coil that is having issue, not knowing is the tracking that is powering the coils and the nozzle. 
And where can one get this tracker? Well, if you want to get it, we we will get it for you. We don't you get it here because we don't expose how we get the tracker. What is your office address? Well, the address is Chooks Solution Motor. You get it at Pijot behind Pijot. Number two behind Pijot. Thank you very much, sir, for having us in your workshop today. You're welcome. All right, thank you, dear viewers. This is the much we can have for today on today's episode of Automobiles. Have a great day and bye.